Hi there, this is Khaled Electronics Made Easy. So I got this uh, Halloween card from Instructables recently. So I thought why not make something uh, for this Halloween this time. And then I thought I should make something scary. Really scary. So I didn't get any idea about that and I was thinking what to make and then I made this. So today we are going to make this scary looking uh, LED eyes and so let's see how to make it. First we'll start by cutting this template of eyes on a cardboard. You can choose a black cardboard or paint the cardboard black. Stick a white paper inside the cardboard to reflect the light through the eyes. Now fold the cardboard in the form of a triangle, like this. Now stick 8 to 10 red LEDs below the eyes inside the cardboard and connect all the positive terminals of the LEDs. Make loops around each terminal like this to connect the terminals without the need of soldering. Now secure the connections with insulation tape and also connect all the negative terminals like this. Use insulation tape to protect the connections. I used a 3.6 volt rechargeable battery to power the LEDs, so I connected all the LEDs in parallel. I used a resistor to protect the LEDs from high currents. I folded the cardboard and secured it with clips temporarily. Now let's test it. I stuck the whole thing with glue and even covered the side parts with triangular pieces to stop any light from escaping. Here I used a 3 ohm resistor array in place of 1 ohm resistor as 1 ohm resistor was heating up. I tested this light in the dark and found that the lights were too bright. So I added a 68 ohm resistor in series to the 3 ohm resistor array. Now the lights look good. Let's test them in the dark. We need some sort of switch to turn on these lights. In this, we are using these small push switches. We need two of them to make the trigger. I stuck both the switches on a wooden piece and connected them in parallel, like this. In this case, by keeping a small wooden piece over the switches, the surface area of the switch is increased. I connected two enameled copper wires to the two ends of the switch. We chose thinner wires so that they won't be noticeable. We can stick the wooden piece over the switches using some glue or some tape. I stuck the battery behind the box using some tape. I connected the native terminal of the battery to the native terminal of the LEDs through a 68 ohm resistor. The positive terminal of the battery is connected to one enameled copper wire of the trigger and the other enameled copper wire is connected to the positive terminal of the LEDs. Now, when we press the trigger, the lights inside the eye switch on. We can keep this trigger under a pillow or a book so that when someone keeps their hand on this pillow, the lights switch on, scaring the person. These lights can be kept inside the cupboard and the trigger under a book so that when someone keeps their hand on the book, the lights switch on. Or the lights can be wrapped up inside a bed sheet or under a pillow like this and the trigger kept under a pillow so that when someone sleeps on the pillow the lights switch on scaring the person. So that's how you can make this uh, scary looking eyes and the advantage of this trigger is that uh, you can keep this under a pillow or a mat so that whenever someone keeps a hand on the pillow or when someone steps on that mat the eyes will automatically switch on and they might scare them really badly. So tr try this with your partner, your sister or your friend or anyone and just scare them and happy Halloween. Thank you. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.